What's up, Hot Wheel fans, Matchbox fans, Johnny Lightning fans of all ages? It's your girl. Say who? Say what? Miss Toy Diva. And I'd like to welcome you all to my channel, Fats Toys. Yes, guys and ladies, I found them. Finally found some Hot Wheel cars from the P case. I've been looking and I've been looking and couldn't find anything. But no, I didn't find them at Walmart. Didn't find them at Target. Didn't find them at what? Toys of Us? No, I found these bad boys at my local CVS and Walgreens house. Like I told you before, the smaller stores are starting to get toys in now because of the holidays. It's Christmas time again, and they're starting to get in Hot Wheel cars and Matchbox cars and the cars that I've been trying to find for the longest. So I'm going to show you some of the cars that I picked up. Might have a couple of errors and a couple of other surprising things as well. Are you ready? Here we go. From the first car that I found, it's a nice one. Been looking for this one for a while. Couldn't find it. And it is no other than the Hot Wheels High. Yes, here's the artwork. And there is the bus right there. The Hot Wheels High bus. Been looking for this bad boy for a minute. Couldn't find it. And lo and behold, it is in CVS House. Yes, I really like this one. And I would love to see the different colors that it comes in. And look at the top right there. Really awesome bus. This is a great bus. A nice future bus. And I really, really like it a lot. And I picked up two of those bad boys. But like I said, when I walked into CVS, the little side panel, I couldn't believe my eyes. Hot Wheels? Yes. So I started going through them. And I grabbed the ones that I've really, really been after for a while. Next is the 70 Chevy Chevelle SS. Here is the artwork and here's the car. This is one badass car. I like the tampos on this car. Look at the colors. Look at the black and the red. I really, really like this one. I like this one a lot. Really, really nice. Been after this one for a while. So I picked up two of them. Like I said, PK's cars, any Hot Wheel cars right now, it's hard to find because collectors are going mad. They're going crazy trying to pick up these awesome cars. I really like the main line, so I'm really happy to have these cars in my collection. Next I have is the 92 Ford Mustang. Here is the artwork, and here it is right here. Is that nice? That's a nice green. Nice tampos with the black and the darker green at the top. Really, really nice. That is awesome right there. And I was lucky enough to find another one. But check this one out. Can you guys check out the difference and see the difference? Paint apps is okay. It's the rims. Yes, this wheel right here was like, whoa. I said, oh, cool, awesome, an uh, error. I'll take it. Don't find too many errors in the house, but I figure, you know what? I'm going to pick it up. Not sure if the same wheel is on the other side, but I'm really, really curious. I might just open it up. So I was really happy to find those three cars and doubles. But what got me the most as I've been looking for this next one from the animation series for the longest. Collectors are snatching it. They're grabbing it. They're hoarding this one. And finally, yes, from the new 2013, here it comes. The USS Enterprise is in the building. Finally, finally, I found this bad boy. That is nice. Everybody is grabbing it. Have to have it. What? What? Have to grab it. I like it, and I see why you guys are grabbing this, and you're hoarding it, and you're grabbing as many as possible. I am at Star Wars, I mean, Star, see, I'm on Star Wars, I'm a Star Wars fan, but I'm a Star Trek fan, I'm a Trekkie, and I have grown up, you know, grew up on this, this awesome uh, series of Kirk and, and the Enterprise and all that, and I had to grab them, but there's another one that they did as well, and I'm going to show you guys that one, this is from the H case, I wanted to show you guys the difference, this is from the P case. You can definitely see 
the battle damage from the PK. So here's the battle damage right here and at the top. And this one was from the H case. It's the regular, the regular uh, USS Enterprise at the top. And the second one from the P case is battle damage. But I was really happy to find them both. Couldn't believe that this one was sitting there as well. They had some older Hot Wheel cars, so I found them this one hanging on the shelf. And I found these, of course, in and it's the shipper. So I picked up another one as well. So I actually have three, two battle damage and one regular. It really doesn't matter whether they're going to be battle damage, whether they're going to be regular. It was just so hard to find the Enterprise. And finally, I have it in my collection. So guys, yes, next. I don't even know. I, I didn't even, let me tell you, I'm going to get props out to all the collectors out there that get these uh, Hot Wheel cases and show us the new main lines, the new treasure hunts, the new supers. Props out to you all. You guys know who you are. You do it every time the new case come out because guess what? If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't know what a tre regular treasure hunt was. I wouldn't know what a super was. But I finally found this one and I'm glad to have it. It is the Mazda RX-7. Yes, treasure hunt. It's the artwork, and here it is right here. And as you can see, it's really, really tiny. I'm going to show you in a minute. I'm going to zoom in on that Circle Flame logo. There it is right there. It's tiny, but you guys can see it. The know that it's the treasure hunt. And I'm going to let you see. Hopefully, I can let you guys see at the bottom of the, the words. There it is. There's that Circle Flame logo right at the bottom to let you know. That that is the treasure hunt. It's tiny collectors. If you guys know it, then you have other other collectors. They don't know it. They're bypassing it. So I picked up not one, not two, but three of these bad boys. Yes, picked them up because nobody didn't know. Let me tell you, I have about a good five CVSs in my area and about three Walgreens and. I think maybe three CVSs has some Hot Wheels cars, and of course Walgreens, I think one Walgreens out of the three had, had Hot Wheels cars. The rest of them didn't have them. But the next one, what? Are you kidding me? Say it one more time. Are you kidding me? Found this in Walgreens' house. It's a 2007 Ford Mustang. Bazing! Must be the rims. Yes, a super is in the house. Here is the artwork, and here is this badass super. Couldn't believe it. Just sitting right there, waiting for me to grab it on a side panel. I like this one. Look at the dark green. Yes, look at the tampos. Look at the rims. And, of course, real riders. Real rubber tires, there they are. And that TH right at the back says Treasure Hunt. This is super sonic, sick looking. Yes, couldn't believe it. I finally found this one. Now, do normally uh, Walgreens and CVS is a little bit expensive. Walgreens runs about a dollar twenty nine for price, and CVS a little bit higher, a dollar forty nine. The stores vary, but to find these awesome badass, finally I got a super in the house. Yes, so guys, there you have it, ladies. There you go. Check out your local CVSs and Walgreens, then pick up these awesome badass cars before they fly off the shelves. Don't forget your family dollar and Dollar General because they're starting to get in toys as well. So guys, there you have it, ladies. There you go. If you like this video, please hit that like button and feel free to subscribe to get my latest and newest videos. Thank you guys all for watching. Thank you very much all for your support. I really appreciate it. All my new bomb diggity badass subscribers, all my new bomb diggity badass viewers, all my new bomb diggity super friends, you are all, what, what, rocking the house. Thank you all for stopping by, and I'll see you all on my next video. This is your girl, Miss Toy Diva. Can you dig it? Holla back, y'all.